You see the through ball? You see the through ball? They're breaking down tape you know right now. who did that? Do you know who did that? Yeah. Look at the through ball. Fresh Boom. Try, try and go on that one. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. That was good. Yeah. Welcome, everyone, to the Jason and OC podcast. But this is a special edition because we have a special individual. He is a winner. But most importantly, he is our friend, FAO Bada. What's happening, my man? Big time FA man, the $10 million man. <laughs> this, this so, so the $10 million man. So spreading these rumors, man. It's, he, he is actively on the show I know. promoting your bonuses from each of your play. And I have confirmed that I'm no longer going to ask him for personal loans. I'm going directly to you. Sign me up. No, I'm, I'm still, no, no that, that's what it's about, man. Like, because I, I know the pressure that comes with people thinking that kind of nonsense. For sure. So I want to put that pressure on you. Thank you. I want to put it on you. It's not true. It's not true. Don't listen to OC. OC just trying to get me in trouble. <laughs> he I think mean, he's just walking around. I with, mean, with, with, with the, man got a, the man got a suitcase I'm in his pocket. You, man. Taxes as well. Tax man. Taxes are real. Taxes are real. How are the taxes in Buffalo, New York? This is aggressive. It's, it's New York. Yeah. So it's oh, yes. Yeah, yeah, aggressive. yeah. It's, 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 we know about that. Yeah, I'm trying to expense my life, but <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't work out as much. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what's up, bro? How are you, man? I'm doing good, man. Thank you for having me. Oh, yeah? It's great to be here. Honestly, man. this is one of my. This is the first experience of this, and it's um, it's overwhelming. Really? Yeah. Te okay, first experience. Like truly, break it down. How do you feel? Like what? What is it? What's the vibe like? I feel to like you? I've arrived. I feel like, like <laughs> I feel big time. You know, I feel like I'm. I'm you know, I'm, I feel like actually a football player now. I feel like Ooh. an NFL player. Yeah. Well, in that T-shirt, I, I think all we got to do is look at you. We know exactly what you are. <laughs> Things is popping out your shirt. Good, man. What bro. is that, thank man? You, that's thank good. You, thank you. See, and, I, and I was in Buffalo, stayed Ooh, out the sun. He flexing. He, 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 he's got that crease. <laughs> <laughs> My tattoos are showing now. <laughs> but yeah. Man. So Buffalo, right? Yeah. You know, I think you guys had a, a, a pretty good season mm. this year, right? Yeah, yeah. What was it like being on that team, watching that quarterback, watching just that? Like, how is that, you yeah. know, as a defensive lineman, seeing a guy take his game to that level? Honestly, it's just, you know, I didn't, I didn't, I wasn't a part of the year before. Mm. But this year, I, th I feel like I felt, I felt the passion. I felt, I felt everything that, how much he really wanted it for, mm. for his team, you know, and how much he put into that into his work into his craft and he's you know he has such a way of just you know flipping that switch and being you know in the locker room he's such a nice guy chill you know funny lots of banter and then when, when we're out on the field on sunday it's just it's a totally different person you, you i was thinking i always say this but sometimes i don't even know if i believe it but when you got a guy like that when you talked about how hard he plays for his team do you step up your game or can you see the entire team kind of elevate the way they play because of him? 100%, 100%. You don't want to let him down. Like, obviously, you don't, you, everybody's out there, we're all individual contractors, but when you have a guy like that that's able to bring the team together and, and, and it, it just, you, it makes you better because mm -hmm. you don't want to let that side down because you're getting an elite performance from him and you, it just, you just want to be that person on, on and you want to be that. 111, they say. You want to have yeah. to be that 111. You want to make sure that your job is done to perfection. Yeah. There's something that has been bothering me for the past 30 minutes. 30 minutes. And yeah. <laughs> what, what's, what's the past that? 30 minutes, what's I've been that? bothered by something. <laughs> share, your, and, share your problems. Share your cards. You know, <laughs> we, were, we were standing over there, j okay. and F.A. F. A. sized me up. He, he did. He I sized did. me up. Yeah. He sized me up. He was like, I'm bigger than you. He gave me, he gave me the, he gave me the once over, right? Just like this. He did me, he did me one yeah, of those. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he was like, I heard you. I heard you play. I heard you play soccer up in Brixton. Oh. That's what he said to me, right? <laughs> and then he challenged my manhood. <laughs> he was like, "I guarantee you, <laughs> I'm better than you." I said, "Wow." What what FA doesn't understand is, for the past seven years, 
you know, while he's been, it's you know, not. playing a different kind of football, <laughs> uh-huh, no, uh-huh. I've been practicing. I've been like yeah. working on my real game. It's not no, no, F A F A. I play four times a week, F A. Four times a week. Four times a oh, week. Oh, yeah. He on don't bad mess around. Knees. On bad knees. Come on. Man. I'm telling you, my progression, <laughs> I am bang in form right now. All right, what position do you play? It doesn't matter. See? <laughs> no, 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 no. Because I play five aside, I play left back. Okay. As a matter of fact, I got something to show you. Hey, okay, he's, no, I got something he's to show real you. about this. I'm going to show you something. He's bringing right out his phone for those that can't see. No, 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 the gonna, man is bringing out his phone for evidence. I'm going to show you something. You know, that's show you my something. Home, he's going right to show you. Yeah. You yeah, know, yeah, it would really yeah. crush him if he was no longer the best former NFL player no, 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 I'm, on I'm the superior. soccer pitch. I'm superior. I'm superior. I have to find it. Wait, so I need you to challenge his greatness. Where did you play? In Brixton. Check this out. He's bringing out a highlight film. I think we need to clip this up and put this out. Hold on. I think he needs to. This needs to be shown for the viewers to watch. Did you see the through ball? Did you see the through ball? They're breaking down tape right now. Do you know who did that? You're going to see him. Look at him. Look at him. I see you. I see they you. don't even. They, this this is more important this than is, coming off the edge. That's me. No, it's not. Getting it, sacked. It, it is me. Look at this. Watch. Look no, at no, this. I know it's you, but you just said it's more important than coming off the edge. <laughs> Nothing is more important than coming off the edge. Well, like, look at the through ball. Press Boom. try, try and go on that one. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. That was good. Yeah. There you so, go. So, so I get down, man. All right, I'm, I'm, I'll, I'll pull up. <laughs> Wrong. Let's make it happen. Really? I'll pull up. I'm, I'm, I'm getting a little scared. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> You're speaking with too much confidence. Yeah. Pull up. I don't like I don't like when people speak. With <laughs> when they speak with confidence, they are gonna pull up. I don't, pull I, don't, up. I don't I don't I don't I don't that 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 makes me. I, I don't I don't do the Twitter and the Instagram. Ooh, just, you just, just come in. Up. You just pull up. Fire. Pull up. Are, you, are you are you trying to? Um, I'm that guy. Yeah, because <laughs> I tell you what. Like sometimes, like when when I when I'm um. Like in the locker room, when I was very, very insecure about a bet, yeah. I would throw out like a, a crazy number. Right? So, so they call yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> so they won't match like, it. Yeah. yeah. I'll be like, if I'm going to race the fastest guy on the team, right? Right. right. I'll be like, yeah. Um, Put up 250k. <laughs> He'd be like, mm-hmm. "There's a chance. There's a chance. I might fall. I might lose." So, are you trying to intimidate me I'm, with? I'm not trying to intimidate. Your skills right now. Listen, we can put 10 pounds on this game. <laughs> I, I feel like I feel like we got action because I know we're serious about this. Look, you see, you see, look at Dex. Now, Dex, Dex knows about my skills. That's why. That's why he's looking at you. He's like, you, know, you don't, you don't know what you're about to get into here. Put your money where your mouth is. Ooh, you better tell him. You better tell him. You come, and we're gonna come to your hood, Brixton, and we're gonna teach you a lesson, uh, FA. Let's do yeah. this. Let's I, do this. I, I'll be on the sideline. Can I? Can I pick my own five aside? Like, no, 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 no. He'll probably show up with Paul Pogba. I'm like, hey, yeah, this is this is my friend. <laughs> this is my friend. <laughs> just, just a guy. Some guys. Hell no. Nah. But Super Bowl, man. How, how do you feel about this particular matchup, uh, uh, FA? I think it's going to be exciting. You know, I'm looking forward to it. And, um, yeah, we, sh- we should have honestly been in the Super Bowl because we had the guys to do it. Yeah. But, I mean, if Buffalo was, you know, a little bit smarter, they would have had you playing a lot more plays. And then, you know, because when you were out there, you performed at such a level. But, you know, sometimes people want to play favoritism. And they want to do things like... <laughs> <laughs> it seems personal. No, it's, 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 per- it's personal for me. Because I, I don't like that. When I, when I was watching you play, and I said this to you earlier, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm a defensive lineman. When I'm watching football, the only thing I watch, I watch the defensive line first. And then as soon as I see that, as soon as I see what they've done, then I look, I look at everywhere else. Right. And I was watching you play and I was like, man, this guy, this guy is like really rushing mm-hmm. with like real technique, real moves, performed at a high level. Right. So the fact that they didn't give you after seeing the same things that I saw and there's no way they don't know, they don't know D-line play like I know them. Yeah. So how, how, how can they not? see what's going on and allow you to play more. It, it, it was ridiculous. Personally, I, I wish I did get some more, um, more opportunities. Mm. Um, you know, but... It's what it is. It is what it is, it's the way the, the chip fell. And um, But I know I can play in this league. Mm. You know, I know that I can help teams win. I know I can affect games. So whatever happens in, in, in my next chapter, I'm just going to have to show that and make that happen. So. How, how long does it take you to decompress? Because I... I picked you guys to be in the in the Super Bowl and against the Rams. That I was going to be a genius. Right. And you were almost there. But how like how long does it take you to kind of you're right there? You know, you're here with us. You're enjoying it. But like, is it on your mind? Is it constantly on your yeah, mind? Yeah, it, it definitely is. But even even while I'm here, you know, even these experiences, you kind of feel 
not not cheated. I don't want to say cheated, but you feel like you missed out on an on, on opportunity that was so close as well. You know, 13 seconds, and you know, and um, and especially just everything that we went through just to get to that point. You know, the the, the ups, the downs, the the individual um, just adversity that we had to overcome. You know, like nobody knows, but um, on my I think the Atlanta game, I had a high ankle sprain, and I worked my ass off. I'm telling you, I six o'clock and every day, like mm. in that building, last one to leave, just to try and get back on that field, and you know, didn't get the result that we wanted. But that was the type of dedication that you was getting from everybody, and you know, across the board. And um, but I'm I'm proud of myself. I'm proud of myself and of what I accomplished. I'm proud of myself that you know, of the type of dedication that I gave to this this game. And I just I just feel like no matter where I go or where I am. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be impactful, and I'm gonna affect games. I'm gonna help teams win, and I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna be me. Your, your past now, the, um, <clears throat> you know, the guys who just come on and oh, they're trying to make yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. You know, you're way <laughs> past that now. Like, like that you're the guy still. who, you know, you <laughs> can actually help a team like win, right? Like, how, how has that transition been for you to go from? Oh, just learning about the game, and then all of a sudden you're a guy who's like, oh, I don't know if if, if he's gonna make. And then now you're officially mm. like a proper NFL defensive lineman <laughs> who anybody would want to have on their team. Like, right. how has that been for you? That's always the goal. That's always been the goal. But obviously, with any, so you, you can play on any team in the NFL. Any, that's that's yeah. That's, yeah. that's without a doubt. Like I play, I play everywhere. I yeah. play def- I play the whole defensive line, and that's I think that's what's my what's really unique about me and my and my skill set that I can add value in the edge inside, it doesn't matter. But um, I think the transition was, you know, it's, it's been cool because initially, it's, like you said, it's learning the game. Yep. Then the next year, you just kind of move that goalpost a little further and then I, I hit that and then it's making the team. Then it's, okay, now it's affecting games. Mm. Now just keep moving the goal and keep moving the goal. And then my next one, hopefully being a Pro Bowl player and mm. also winning a and then like Super Bowl. And I'm speaking that big right money, now. Big money, big money. I'm getting that loan, baby. <laughs> let, me tell you something. Let, me, let me tell you Let me tell you something. Baby. Let me tell you something. What's up? What's up? If. So take, talk to me nice. I think, I, think, I think that, I think if you were to make a Pro Bowl, I think I'll probably cry. You will? Yeah. I appreciate it. Yeah. Because, you know, it's it's just when you see the well not the beginning but like in the early stages right yeah and then to it was see, the beginning we was in Florida right? yeah and I, it's, it's I crazy imagine my start yeah, but yeah. imagine now you see that over and it hasn't even been that long right because right. pe- people have been playing this game their whole lives right right, right. since they were like five six pee wee to go from that and then all of a sudden boom this guy's a Pro Bowl player it it would be it would be one of the the greatest things that I've seen in terms of American football. It, it would be ridiculous. I'm right? gonna make it happen. Yeah, I'm gonna make it happen. There's a there's a small nuance to like making Pro Bowl because you have to play a certain amount of snaps. Yep. Yeah. So if I can get those certain amount of snaps, I'm very confident in my abilities that I I will be a Pro Bowl player. Oof. I like it. I, I like it. it. It's fascinating what you've done. I mean, you two have been a part of this this movement, right? Um, getting great athletes, introducing them to this game, having success. You are the poster for this, poster. Yeah. period, bro. Like, it's crazy what you're, you've are you been able to do. You were saying something earlier, and I, I'm, I'm quite interested in this. Uh, you talked about, you know, even the ankle and, and, and going through things. Like, what this, what in this season, through the game, because we understand a season feels like years, right? It does. What do you think? What did you learn about yourself? And I say that because each year I found out something different about myself. Mm. And I just added on to that till it was over. And then I could really say, I am this kind of person. Mm. Like, what did the game bring you? It's something about you personally that you're like confirmed or a new discovery. Um, I think. So on the field, Mm -hmm. like just through just through the adversity, this is probably the only time where in Buffalo where I felt like my body has let me down to a point where it's taken me off the field. Mm. And, you know, prior to that, you know, we had football is a 100% injury rate. Everybody, nobody is 100%. Everybody's playing through something. And this is the point, this is the only point where I felt like it's 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 let me down a little bit. And just the, the way that I've managed that, the way I manage my mind, my emotions, 
the way I, I, I handled that recovery process just lets lets me know that I'm a I'm a beast. I'm a dog. Like I mm. like I can I can play this, and I'm I'm here I'm here to stay. But on, also on the flip side, on a personal level, um, the fact that I didn't get the opportunities that I wanted, and I was able I was on the sideline most of the time, kind of allowed me to kind of step out of that routine, that matrix lifestyle, mm. and then. Maybe, and then focus a little bit more on my personal life. So, you know, with my wife and just, you know, just being at home, be more present mm. and just kind of enjoying the journey and, and um, a little bit more because I'm very goal focused. I'm very, my, my head in the sand. And that's, I think that's a good thing because it's got me to the point where I'm at right now, mm. but it allowed me to kind of, you know, smell the roses a little bit and also see the game from a different perspective. And also let you know that I never want to be on the sideline again. <laughs> I never want to, especially in the cold. Like, forget the cold. <laughs> being on the side, like playing in the cold, yeah. But being on the sideline in the cold, I don't want that that's, anymore. that's something else. That, that's, that's motivation in itself. So there's just there's just loads of different things that I've I've taken personally from 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 uh, Buffalo and this experience that I feel like it's definitely going to add you know value to myself and my life. You know? It, it truly is setting you up for success in whatever you do. Um, one thing you're gonna be is a winner for life. I mean, there's not a lot of people that will take on the challenges you have. There's a and term that Nigerians use called Niger don't carry last. <laughs> you never come never. lost. You never come last in anything. We're, prepared. <laughs> We're winners. We won't come last regardless. Oh, see, am I lying? He ain't lying, bro. <laughs> we won't. You'll never see it. It won't. won't happen, huh? You'll won't happen. never see it, bro. Man, like, we'll find a way. I I feed off of this. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate both <laughs> y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Main man, F.A. in the building, man. We're yeah. here. It's hey, been cool. Thanks for having me. I just want to let everybody know to check us out on the Super Bowl. We'll be together Ooh. doing it live. Definitely. F.A. dropping those nuggets for us, <laughs> fresh out the locker room. <laughs> so it'll be a good time, man. It's going to be, I'm just, I'm just excited, man. I'm excited too. I'm Let's excited make it happen, too. brother. Who's the best Thank defensive you. lineman in the NFL, in your opinion? In my right opinion, now. the best defensive yeah. lineman? Best. That's just the last question. I, I want to know where you, where you sit on this. There's a lot of guys that get a lot of, like, camera time and exposure, mm. but then there's also a lot, a lot of guys that, put the numbers out consistently, mm. you know, and I don't think you can pick out just one person that you kind of have to kind of group them around, you know, with the TJ Watts and the Aaron Donalds and the, you know, uh, just just guys like that. I think mm. I think you kind of gravitate to just because of who they are and, and what they've done consistently, the Bolsa families, the, mm. you know, things like that. So yeah. uh, there's just so many to, cho to choose from. Is TJ Watt a, a better pass rusher than, say, um, let's say a Nick Bosa? You think TJ Watt is a better pass rusher than a Nick Bosa? Or do you think TJ Watt is a better pass rusher than a Von Miller? What about Miles? Miles is a it's, it's it's different. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a different. You can't even do that. That's different. You can't even, you can't even do that. Yeah. I got to exit the build yeah, now. That's yeah. different. I think I mean, Miles, it, it, Miles Garrett, for sure. Yeah. That's different. That's different. Yeah. That's, that's like God given. You know, there's a lot of guys that are God-given. There's a lot of guys that work hard for it. There's a lot of guys that are great pass rushers. There's yeah. some guys that are system-based as well. Mm. You know, um, and there's, some, there's a lot of guys that are living right. And I think I might've said this to you about Miles Garrett. Like when I was, when I would watch him, I was like, I just, <laughs> this I is ridiculous. Just, I saw a play of Miles Garrett and he, I think he rushed three different guys. Yeah, and still got the sack. still got the I was like, wow. It's crazy. You know? Crazy. And it's, you're kind of built like Miles, though, you know? I know. I just need, I need, I need more legs. The legs. I need more legs. <laughs> I need, I need to just, I need the opportunity. Yeah. You know? But I, yeah. Effie, I don't know, bro. <laughs> Effie, I think, I think you could, I think you're going to be a great player. I am. But I think that guy's different. <laughs> <laughs> that guy, that guy, that guy is different, bro. That guy is definitely oh, blessed. Oh god, he is definitely blessed. I, like I, I don't think there's nothing I can do. It's like, <laughs> <laughs> make me. That one you just gotta. You, just gotta oh, watch that. <laughs> you got it, bro. Oh gosh, you too, man. You know, but I, I feel that, but I'm definitely gonna call out my own, um, my own, my own corner, my own, my own lane. Yeah. But yeah, but Miles is definitely different. Yeah. Yeah.
What, what, what about you? What's your opinion? Who's, who do you think is a... Yeah, I, I think Miles is different. <laughs> but I, I, I'm just so... Why, why did you ask that question? Who do you think is the... Um... Because I, I think, you know, when I was playing, towards the end of my career, I saw Vaughn, and I was like, this this is... He's, he's real. This is this guy is real, mm, right? Yeah. And then now you see the guys like TJ Watt, the Bosa's come up. But mm. then as a guy who's a pass rusher, right? Mm. There's a difference between somebody who's putting up numbers, who everybody sees is putting up numbers, mm -hmm. and then the guys who are like rushing. Like mm. us, like we, we would watch, we'd watch defensive ends, we'd watch defensive line play, and there can be a guy who has 15, 20 sacks and a guy who has 10. Like look at Robert Quinn, he was, he killing it, but nobody really heard about him. Exactly. Yeah. So we, we would look at things different. So right. it, it was just, I just wanted to hear what you would say right. being in the league right now. I get that. Yeah. Yeah. Pass rushing clinics. Yeah. I love it. We out here. We out here. We blessed. FA, Super Bowl, ready to go, man. Appreciate the time, my Thank brother. You. Thanks for having me, F.A. Jason and Osi podcast. There we go. Ooh, I like that. That's what we got going on. We right got now. enough I like money for my, I like the way you put my name first as well. Yeah. Uh, no, your name, your name isn't here at no, all. No, I know, but you said F.A. So F.A. Jason, yeah. yeah. You said yeah. Jason and Osi or Osi? F.A. Jason and Osi, yeah. yeah. Why, why are you it's that? the only time my name is before Osi. <laughs> yeah. Anything. And it's completely by accident. <laughs> <laughs> we out. The right. F.A. Jason and Osi podcast. Nice, nice. <laughs>